getting back into Elder Scrolls. Sorry, I'm on a bit late. Work went a bit later than normal. So, yeah, I'm a little bit later than normal as a result. to hop on just before the day changes. This one welcomes you back! Select your rewards, my friend. A lovely prize. Your crits are gone, but there are always more available. Your crits are gone, my friend, but there are always additional crates available for purchase. Farewell, my good friend. Wait, I'm gonna delve.
you find the vent. Good. Don't show it to me. The Hagaragans know things about those who serve them. I'm not a vengeful march across Hrothgar. The orcs of this land want anything. A vengeful march across Hrothgar. Long ago, two orc brothers tried. They planned to melt it down in the forge near Malakath's great statue. Mercedine, beast of the reach, daughter of... Don't think too long. Destroyed it. Now to make a show of helping with the search. Hopefully we'll soon be gone, as should you be. Shit. <laughs> Thank you. 
That was supposed to be the wandering. That would have been the waste round I used anyway. I don't want to be before. Just big enough to do damage. It's pathetic how tiny they are.
I did a nice combo with that genius. Ayate. Probably behind Mara. Staying for it, but fuck it, I'm running. Sorry, right? An onion. Have faith. A sculpture begins as a block of stone. What is this? This masterpiece? Delivered as promised. What is this mess? Mess? Well, this is an authentic replication of ogre artwork, as requested. The materials came straight from an ogre den. By the bloody curse, Dorinar! It reeks! Ah, oh, you understand? I understand the gorge rising in my throat! <laughs> it's... perhaps not my best work. <laughs> it all... Okay, so honors arrest. Okay. 
I ain't doing right now. Do sorry, and then I'll find on his rest. Probably that one. Yeah. Wretched mountain will you again. Oh, habit of showing up when my lady needs you. Suppose that means we're gonna make another attempt to reach that wretched summit after all. This is Sorrow, half name, don't you think? The house of Orsama Glories in Orsinium engaged my lady's services to find the shrine of Tora Groigron. Supposedly. Only if you consider vile beasts, freezing winds, and falling ice to be a problem. We've tried to climb the mountain three times now, and this expedition has really proved to be more troublesome than Lady Laurent, the famous treasure hunter. I'm sure you've heard of her. We found the house of Orson and Legends Clay. Karsten works for the museum. Damn you, Karsten. How am I supposed to make a great discovery when... Oh, hello! I was just... Just you. Well, I was hoping for porters and guides and all, but I suppose that I can make do. I'll need to make a... Oh, the last three times, you mean. We set up one camp, but the harpies and the icy wind cut us down each time we climbed higher. A few orcs even wandered into a... It's a start. Head up and present yourself to Karsten while I go check on my lazy manservant, Stibbins. We'll meet you up there. I, uh, why are you still here? We're not just... According to a scroll... The museum is...
in the name of Malakath's third tusk are you? Don't you know this is sacred? Oh, she did, did she? I hope you know what you're getting into. Harpies and ogres are bad enough, but the true challenge of Sorrow... Avalanches! Sorrow wields her snow and ice with terrible precision. I've seen strong orcs swept right off the side like scoring a slaughter in seven-pick knockdown. We tried three times and lost most of our expedition. To be honest, I'm not sure. We barely made it this far before we got separated from the others. If you could look for our companions, that would be helpful. Regardless, we have to find Torug's shrine or all the... The good orcs, each and every one of them. Expert climbers. But Sorrow isn't an ordinary mountain. Best way to find them? They should have placed markers to indicate avalanche areas. Sorrow may not be the tallest mountain in Tamriel, but it's certainly one of the deadliest. That's why the ancient orcs built memorials to their chief. We're looking for the shrine of the great orc hero, Tora Groegron. Legend says that Torog's shrine sits at the very top of the mountain as befits the founder of the original Orsinium. But it's so high up that nothing can... Extremely. We've already tried to get up there three times. I work for Orsinium's newly... Her reputation brought her to the attention of the museum, and she loves digging around in old tombs. At first, we got along fine. We both love history and exploring ancient sites. But the woman has been driving me crazy. She lacks the fundamental... Don't you dare put down that firewood. It won't do us any good if it gets wet. You make a sound point. And threat on the car. Come on. This is going to be fun. No, don't waste your time. I'm done for. And Avalon, the others, they went on ahead to seek shelter. That sucks. What the hell are the rats alive up here? Jesus, that was a bit of an avalanche. Follow the mark. 
Kaga. Stones. this fascinating most yeah. of the monuments up here are inscribed with three stanza epitaphs it was a common practice this rubbing appears to be Tarug's first stanza it's written in old orcish proclaiming the memorial's inaccessibility well obviously they found the shrine higher up on the mountain as to why they came here to die I have no idea Maybe the cold or the lack of supplies drove them down. Or they were coming back. Let me translate this rubbing. No looters. No lesser orcs. Remarkable. Ow. We should try to find the other two stanzas. That are more nuts. These poor orcs. Stivix, be a deer and bury them. Leaping.
Okay, it's fairly soon it's gonna be all right. Oh, well, it's right now. Thons is apparently not. That was the first one. magic. Let me take a look. Torog wasn't pleased that they built his shrine below the summit. He wanted to rest at the top. Does it say anything about the armlet of Torog? He carried it to the summit. It says he laid Sorrow's kiss upon it. Yes, Zubka. I'm certain it's kiss. Sorrow's kiss? The same phrase from the fragment. Doesn't that sound so romantic, Stiggins? Very so romantic. I'm sure it's now, Stibbins, really, leave the translating to the experts. In the meantime, I must speak to our friend. Isn't this wonderful news? To protect his own tomb from looters and to ensure his legend among his people, Torig climbed to the summit and he took his relic. Ugh, haven't we been over this? I swear, sometimes I think you hear one word I say out of every three. You're almost as bad as my manservant Stibbins. <laughs> it's written in stone. Hyperbole to keep undesirable. I don't agree with Carl. I must say, I'm relieved that you volunteered to ascend the summit. I was so I envy you. But don't worry. If the summit takes you, then I will be here to attempt to climb after you die. It's the least I could do. Is this where I start freezing?
zdjęć. Oh shit. Look, our friends have returned to their senses. Oh, I told you they weren't dead, Stibbins. And look, that must be the armlet of Torog. I refuse to let you go through with your plan, Lady Laurent. Oh, really, Karsten, not that again. We clearly have more to discuss. Stibbins, see to our friends. You missed all the drama while you were unconscious. Lady Laurent. It's the thin air up here, but whatever you did made the weather calm down, so we followed you up. That's when Karsten and Lady Laurent started arguing. Karsten thinks the shrine would be a... Oh, most indubitably. The museum hired her to acquire relics, and she hates to dis... I'm glad you... So it would seem. This shrine stands as a tribute to our past... The armlet of Torog should remain in his shrine. Make sure every orc plan... I knew you'd see it my way. You sided with Karsten? After all we've been through? It's been decided. Torog's relic stays in Torog's shrine. The poor orcs have to climb up here to see a piece of their heritage? That's positively criminal. Wait, what's Stibbins doing with the relic? A little faster, Stibbins. I'm anxious to see what the relic actually does. But, my lady... What if I'm not worthy? Nonsense. We're not afraid of legends and superstitions, are we? No, my lady. Of course not. Mm. Here goes nothing. <laughs> oh, Stibbins. What did you do this time? Hmm. Maybe your manservant was right. Maybe it does say Sorrow's Curse. Stibbins always finds a way to turn the simplest task into an ordeal. I don't know why I let him accompany me on my adventures. But, and what am I supposed to tell the House of Original Galleries, or whatever it is the orcs call their museum, that they have an annex all the way up here? In a moment, someone at the Mage's Guild will help me thaw out Stibbins. It may take weeks to warm him up, but he'll be fine. Give me a moment, and I'll open a portal back to our base camp. Portal? So why did we have to make that harrowing climb? <laughs> Teleportation is a delicate business. You can't just open a portal to some place I've never seen. Fair point. Don't crack my manservant. Honestly, you orcs approach everything like you're going to war. Perhaps you'd like to carry him, your majesty. I'm still not gonna do honor's rest, wherever the hell that is.
this the right way. Hey, this is what I want. This is a great discovery. Ten years. Shirella and I spent ten years looking. Bayloth Bloodtusk was an orc hero, cruelly slain by Gaiden Shinji in a rigged duel. And Shirella swears this is Gaiden Shinji's tomb. Orc stone in orc lands, honoring the murderer. I'll be grateful if you get through to Shirella. I already wrote Orsinium about our findings. Can you imagine if she denies Bayloth blood? 
Baylot Bloodtusk was the finest warrior to call Rothgar home. Some say he was an avatar of Malakath himself. Don't believe the tales. He didn't wrestle giants, slay dragons, or ride a giant bear. But he carved out a place 30 years into the siege of Old Orsinium. Guide, according to legend, the story is denying the tale. Baylot, don't believe the tale. I know, I know, foolish. You speak with Lozreth. I know he's a the door to this tomb commemorates Gaiden Shinji's final duel. His image is identical to engravings from that period. There's no question it's him. He yes, he's the orc opposite Shinji, which is why this can't be Bayloth Blood Tusk's resting place. Though venerated by Rothgar's orcs, Bayloth was little more than an opportunist. I we don't know. The door won't open, so it's all theory. But I'll stick. They hold Gaiden Shinji responsible for Old Orsinium's destruction. When they see this is actually Shinji, the indentations by the door are for burial urns. No doubt, some sort of key. There are catacombs nearby. If you can find them in the cat, the greatest. Right. Now I go downstairs.
thought I killed you. addition to the king's letter, Lord Tristan wishes to convey his sincere condolences. Sir, I am no knight. Call me savage as you would behind our backs. I will not, sir. Treat all with honor until proven otherwise, as my Lord Tristan teaches. Does your Lord Tristan think I'm above killing the messenger? A special message such as I do not presume, sir. I deliver the message as my lord requests, and his condolences. Well, presume yourself a bowl of <gasps> stew before you run back to your lord. I'll not feed you till I come. Stay. Yes. Yes, sir. Oracle, we must speak. Tomorrow the savage sons march to kill 10,000 Bretons. Before we arrive, King Golkar will crap out another statue of Malakath to lie. The king can preach orc unity all he wants, but what he needs is beauty. For us to bleed out in the dagger fight we started with the Bret. It was. Until a few minutes ago. Another king. That Breton king? Joal? Fight with me, or the same will happen to you. Blah, blah, blah. You're too dumb to notice a subtle threat, so I'll throw it in your face. And now we march. <laughs> All right. Damn it, I've already respawned. before
Olaf Bloodtusk has reinforced Orsinium. Our losses to his savage sons were considerable. The king should call off the siege. The battle is unjust. Shinji, Mercedine now commands us. The siege will not end. Mercedine? Beast of the Reach is your general? There's another way. Challenge Baloth to a duel. You could end the siege with a swing of your blade. The orcs will never hey, oh. agree. The orcs love Baloth more than their own king. He'll agree. His people have bled enough. What would your king say? He appointed Mercedine. Yeah. King Joal suggested this. He needs a victory and won't care who delivers it. <sighs> then it shall be. The Order of Diagna will march to Orsinium. Tomorrow, come speak with me. Uh. Not good. Not good at all. I have a spell. Damn it. Actually, I probably could have just logged out and logged back in. Too late now.
just leg it this time. I swear to God, if I'm... No fucking around this time, Wade. Right? Do you see how King Jual forces my hand? If I refuse to challenge Baloth Blood Tusk, the Breton King will demand Lord Tristan do so. In no. I do not slight Lord Tristan. He leads the Knights of the Dragon. His honor and skill with a blade are without question. But Baloth, the orcs claim him a warrior without equal. Of more importance, so do his opponents. Cunning, quick, and patient. He bides his time, and there are few left with skill to match my own. Ha! You've spent too much time around me. Okay. I like maybe they were both buried here. I said this is the tomb of Gaiden Shinji. Lothrin, what is this nonsense? Shirella speaks for herself. This is the tomb of Baloth Blood Tusk. There is no question. Well, I have a question. Has your partner lost her damn mind? None of this will matter once we open the tomb. At which point, Shirella will be proven wrong. That I can trust my partner to back my findings? Yes, Lozrith is correct. Orsinium did not send me to mediate a family quarrel. Figure out whose tomb this is, or I'll have the army drive you out. It worked. Shirella, you were right. Yes, Lothrith. Lothrith, do you see this? Not just that. Order of Diagna and Savage Sons intermingle. 
Orc stonework never presents enemies in equal standing. It seems an impossible thing. Yet we see it before us. There must be more answers within. Yeah, they're both buried here. <laughs> they must have both died. Don't believe it. One is clearly Gaiden Shinji, but the other. Bela Blightus, memorialized in stone. This is their t Both of them? They were mortal enemies. How can this be? There must be a reason. We should look around, learn how this was possible. They were friends, I think. Forced to fight each other. Go on, then. Kill me. At least I took a few of you traitorous bastards down before the end. I saw them killing Knights of the Dragon. Then you really don't know? Who are you? Lord Tristan? The one who devised the duel? It won't solve anything. The duel is a trap, but not because of your lord. How well do you know your own king? Jual isn't fighting for peace or for his people. He's here to conquer. When Orsinium falls, Hammerfell remains. But Gaiden Shinji was the... Find them. Warn them if you can. To pull Shinji here, they needed Bela. She is the... Just before the... What do you say of that? I shall reconsider the proper. You'll have to defeat me to pass it off. True enough. The best techniques are passed on by the survivors. That's a good proverb. Archers, no! <laughs> it just sounds like they're sparring. General Mercedes, what have you done? A duel for a city? Pathetic. King Joy Lee wanted victory, and today I deliver it. Curse you, General Mercedes! To the depths of oblivion, I curse you! Fool! If you bear them so much love, fall and die beside them! General Mercedes killed them both. She dishonored their do <sighs> My wounds. I cannot face General Stay your hand, young orc. Too much blood was spilled this day. Enough heroes lost. Agreed. The duel. Did you see it? Was there a victor? I saw a willow and a grot oak dancing in the wind. I felt their styles vastly different. Until I realized... Adhere to the style that defeats your opponent. People used to claim it was Shinji's proverb. Always made Baloth crack a smile. <sighs> hmm. Done? Oh, good. Then 
knights of the dragon will have no part in King Zhuo's treachery. Come, we must pray. It was a mistake to involve the order in King Zhuo's folly. I must atone. Gaiden Shinji wished to be buried in the land where he fell, no matter where that might be. Fitting. He never called one place home for long. He all You'd be surprised. We could not miss what Shinji and Valov tried to do. If his brother does not object. Did you? What happened? I thought I was some place. Whoever built this place, they wanted us to know the truth. Baylor, Blood Tusk, and Gaiden Shinji tried to end the siege to stop the killing. Uh, patch things up with Shirella. <laughs> We've worked together for years. I won't let this break us. The king will know the truth. This is Baloth Blood Tusk's tomb, and altering any piece of it will mar his legend. The king won't dare touch Gaida and Shinji's remains, especially not once I write. So Gaiden Shinji and Baloth Blood Tusk were pulled into a war neither wanted. They dueled to stop an endless siege. And they died betrayed by the plots of a Breton king. Every legend has some truth behind it. Perhaps this tomb will help us find the truth in Gaiden Shinji's legend. Yes? About what? Now that we found Baloth Blood Tusk. And Gaiden Shinji. Of course. Explore. It could take years. Years? Do you think? I... Yes. It could take years. What are you saying, Lozrev? Uh, could we, perhaps... Well, that is, if, if you're interested. It, it may be... Study this tomb together? Yes. <laughs> uh, that is, if you're interested. Uh, are you interested? You look not interested. Okay, so, Orsinium's done. Yes? Name it. Top listing in every journal. But I thought we'd agreed on alphabetical. <laughs> Lozareth, you still can't tell when I'm pulling your tusk? Oh, <laughs> uh, so uh, we continue as we were? If of they see his joke, he is playing this next. That easily. Oh, good. That's <clears throat> good. Okay, so that's it for Ossinium. No, I understand. If you change your mind, I'll be here. Pick these up later. Are you here about the job? To forestall any confusion, yes, we split the process. You mean you aren't here about the notice? Well, allow me to explain. I need a partner for a difficult job. It pays well, but it involves travel, and there is... I'm so glad you came along. I've chartered a ship. When you're ready, meet me there. Here, I'll mark your map. Bring some lockpicks. They sell them here if you don't have any. Oh, and wear some... Let's talk about details when we rendezvous. It's not that I don't trust you. I'm just... I don't think I've made a good impression in this place. That is, if you're... I've never had a partner. I mean... On all other big jobs I've done, which I did alone, quite successfully, and most of the people I interviewed thought the rendezvous was too far away. Well, I paid for a ship in advance. I didn't realize how far I'd have to look to find a suitable partner. For the job, I mean. But we can talk about this at the dock.
Walker, talk. You will talk to Bakum? Oh, praise Alkash. This one is very worried. Bakum's sister-in-law's uncle's cousin has been writing strange letters. So strange, something about the, the maw of Lot high in the mountains to the south of Dokrin. The rivers are shallow there, but bright moons. Bakum? Yes, yes, of course. Takanrad has always had a sugar-sweet disposition. Very sour. Bakum is look, does it? Oh shit, okay. Uh, that's a group instance. Not today. It. I wasn't certain you... Well, I'm glad you're here. So, the details. We're headed to a remote patch of land called Falstrom Homestead. It's owned by some thane from Eastmarch. He's at war, but his staff and guards remain. We're looking for a relic called the Geovesson Skull. We slip inside the treasure room, grab our prize, and depart before anyone knows the difference. Oh, one more thing. I prefer not to spill any blood. But I leave our safety to your discretion. If a guard sees you, take shelter. This little tub will get us to a blockade runner offshore. The newest job is always the biggest job. Well, this is the biggest job I've ever attempted. None whatsoever. Anything else you take? Maybe I need to text some, um... Head to the manor, quick and silent. The sentries are Windhelm Guard, on loan from someone important. If they give chase, find a hiding spot. The water between the two grates? Full of slaughterfish. Just trying to avoid guards. Okay, apparently not just guards. You wouldn't leave, so I called the guards. Are you stupid? Or just hard of hearing? No matter. Tell it to the guard. What are hiding spots look like?
Parce que... Answer. That blue always there. Okay, it's how far they go in the other direction. I don't know if I got time for this mission right now. Quest, I should say. I'm gonna turn around here, they're gonna keep going. Should arrive at any moment, trespasser. Ah, uh, fuck, I probably could have made that. It's safe and sorry, though. Is a problem. 
One moment. Lifting the gate while I turn the That's it! I knew it would pay off. Okay, he's walking. Okay, he's walking. Damn, I keep thinking this is Assassin's Creed. Oh my god, I gotta get past him somehow. Guard right there. Hmm. See the one that was lying down. Yeah. Can't get in this way either, can I? I can't climb. did bring lockpicks, didn't you? Yes. Hmm. Lockpicks won't work on those doors. Some sort of mechanism, maybe? That's one clever thing, but not clever enough. You clue in here somewhere. I had a key. 
Nick, come on, let's go find the Geovessin Scar. Uh, I just had to permutate all the different combinations. There it is. It's so shiny. Surrender, thief. The manor is surrounded. Today, the Iron Wheel brings you to justice. What? Who are you? Chief Inspector Ron Beek. We foiled your attempt to steal the Geovesson skull. Will you also confess to stealing Magnifica Falora's dowry? What's a Falora? See, Damn. it doesn't matter. Return the Geovesson skull and surrender, or face the consequences. No idea what he means. I'll, I'll follow your lead. I probably sh should have tried to escape. Wake up, partner. We need to get out of here. Who was that? What was all that? Nobody. Well, I sent word to the Thieves Guild of Abar's Landing. They were interested in acquiring the Geovesson skull. Abar's Landing was to be our next stop. But why would this iron wheel set an ambush here? Of course, you're right. The iron wheel could return at any moment. There's someone coming. You don't know me yet, but I'm a friend. Quen, isn't it? Put on this uniform and head outside. How the iron wheel won't detain a Windhelm guard. I only had one uniform. Ah. Recover your boat and meet us by the catacomb exit. Then we can return to the Thieves Guild in the bar's landing. Of course, there's only one bloody uniform. She'll be fine. Looks like we take the dangerous way around. Did I mention I'm afraid of spiders? Oh my Probably god. I should have mentioned. I'll keep it under control. Just don't get in the way. Look, a crypt. Nothing bad ever happens in a crypt. <laughs> Drogo too. Great. Just great. Fan flippantastic. to fall God I just want a bed blueprint is that too much to ask
fucking fish. Interesting recipe. Ah. Uh. Are we running? No. All right then. God, I'm glad I'm not playing this in VR. Sorry. Disgusting. Follow me. We're almost there. Is that the size spiders? They're good pest control. A spider that big? It's no. Fuck off. I don't think they saw me. Are you all right? You're greener than my favorite vest. It's fine. I'm... I'm fine. Could have lived my entire life without running to a spider pit. But the Thieves Guild and my Guildmaster, who can explain why the Iron Wheel thinks you deserve the same fate they've inflicted upon us. It's an unpleasant fate. It involves bread. You are your own master, but the Iron Wheel is relentless, and they know your face. They know your partner's face, too. When you're up to it, We'll head to the thieves' den. It's in an old cistern. Oh, cistern. Wonderful. I'm to be surrounded by water everywhere I go. Yes, yeah, so she's not great with water. You have a bounty on your head. Try to keep away from the guard. Always a pleasant journey to Abba's Landing. Hidden within an old cistern that's long forgotten by the city's merchant lords. A new home for us after the Iron Wheel. Avoid guards. Although, isn't this like a um, free city? Like, is there actually any guards? Wait. That's a bad idea if ever I saw one. Another one? Let's 
Justice and Charity. Hey, that's... I think... The cops are great. The rooftops and you're safe. This place is nice, but it's not a home. Feels like I'm hiding down here. Don't play coy. I see it in your eyes. You've killed people. Or you will. You've got this... You never heard of Tamriel's most... Word of advice. Urges aside. So don't... I don't want you to do anything. Don't take my willingness to help out as a... No need to be all in... That's one of the best things. Quite a few, actually. Fellowship, safety, and security to me. I'm not one... Oh, I got... You really don't know anything about... I don't want you to... Don't take my will. Hey, I don't know exactly how these police. Okay. Oh, Dark Brotherhood, I did not want to do that just yet. Fuck, I'm not even sure I want to do that. Over here, we should speak. Walk softly sent word of your time at Fulstrom Homestead. Said you... I am, but call me Zira. Titles don't carry weight when you live in a cistern. Pretty bold of you and Quen to go after the Geovesson's skull. Did you know she sent a letter asking to set up a meet? <laughs> Rookie mistake. The iron... That's why I sent Walk softly to pull you out. Don't get me wrong, Quen may be green, but she planned a real heist. The kind we used to pull off before the Iron Wheel captured it. You heard of Magnifica Valora? She's a noble from Tanith, with a substantial dowry in her family tomb. We tried to steal it, but we failed, and she hired the Iron Wheel to punish her. If the great Chief Inspector Ron Beak thinks you're part of the Guild, who am I to disagree? We need good thieves, capable thieves like you and Quen, to pull ourselves out of the gutter. So, care to join the Thieves' Guild? We have nowhere to go but up. No one want to join the Thieves' Guild? Good. You aren't afraid of a challenge. The more you do for us, the more gold and respect you'll earn. Reputation goes a long way with us. I told you about our failed heist, the one that led the Iron Wheel to Abba's Landing. Someone pointed them in. My gold is on Velsa. She was part of our Thieves' Council, the Guild's inner circle. But she retired just before the dowry heist. It might be coincidence. Or it might be she sold us out for large stacks of coin. That's what I'd like to find out. You and I should pay her a visit, see if the Iron Wheel funds her retirement. There's a breach in the city wall. Thieves should always come. Said she'd earned enough for a life. Our old guild master. Housing is interactable because <laughs> the Thieves Guild probably doesn't want you stealing all their shit. Oh.
Damn, that's a load of coin. Oh. I'm gonna leave it there. <laughs> Get in with the Thieves Guild. If you're watching this on YouTube, please like and subscribe. If you're watching on Twitch, please consider following. If you're watching on YouTube and you want to check out the Twitch stream live, it will be in the description below. Or you can check me out at twitch.tv slash 96 Cool. I should be back on tomorrow night, continuing on with Thieves Guild mission. Till next time, see you later.